welcome to a very special announcement for the Civ Battle Royale. My name is Dawkins, and tonight there won't be part 120. I know, ooh, ah, that's not good news for many of you who don't follow us on Reddit, but we're coming to an end, guys. We're coming to an end of the Mark 2.1 and getting ready and raring to go for the Seabricks, the CBRX. If you are not familiar with what's going on in Reddit, we have been approaching, again, the end game, where turns are turning out to be about 80 hours in length per part. So uh, Rion Monteras, who has been recording the game, is out of slides right now. So again, if you haven't been caught up with what's going on on the subreddit, I'm going to read what Rian Monteras and Blue Cassette has published as of late. So here it goes. Hello, since my last update, we've had several parts of Total War between the powers of the CBR. Twists and turns abound, these parts have been pretty exciting to say the least, but one thing remains constant throughout. Brazil. With blazing speed, at least in game turns anyway, Brazil has eliminated one opponent after another taking on average around 25 to 30 cities a turn since the total war was declared. Yikes, that's complete domination. To tell you the truth, it was quite faster than we expected. We were expecting some push and pull with Brazil at war with literally everyone, but it seems as it is that it's Brazil's destiny to rule everything. As part of this veritable blitzkrieg, again, in game turns, Brazil has captured more cities than nearly any AI ever has in any AI game ever. That makes us excited, but it also makes things difficult. As you may have noticed in the power rankings, the team is pretty set on what they think will be the final order of civs. There is really only one question, and that is whether Korea or Vietnam will die first. So for part 120, as I had announced at the, par at the point where Total War was declared, we planned for eventually going to bi-weekly parts as the part backlog eroded and turns became ever longer. However, the speed at which Brazil has conquered things has made it so the last few parts, which would release over the course of a couple of months this summer, would mostly be a snooze fest of waiting on Brazil to capture the final capitals. Long gone would be any semblance of suspense, the final death order of Civ determined long ago. Due to this fact, we have decided that tonight's part, or at this release, when part 119, will be the penultimate part of the CBR Mark II, and part 120 will be the final part. So what does this mean for you? Well, the simple answer is, no more parts until the game completes. In order to avoid slipping into fewer and fewer turns with less interesting things happening, every turn after tonight's part, or previous week's part, will be rolled into one mega part to finish off the series. What will we do on Tuesdays going forward, or Wednesdays, wherever you are? I leave that in your capable hands. We are thinking of returning the weekly update, possibly on a bi-weekly schedule, and maybe with some neat recap content on the off weeks, but we're really leaving that up to you as to what you want. Let us know what you think would make some good content to put on in the interim. As usual, I'd like to thank all of you for the time and effort you put into making this community great. I'm proud to be part of this, and I hope you guys stay hyped both for part 120 and for Seabricks, which will be coming, I guess, sooner than we think. It's starting to get rary and ready to go. Uh, some of the content that we had in mind is a look back on some things, some alternate history posts, and also the Groundhog Day Sea Bricks testing that Laxorax Oriskel has been doing. There's a bunch of stuff that we have in the, in the works, but if there's something you have in mind that you want to see, either before the release of Sea Bricks or as a post-mortem for the CBR Mark 2.1, let us know. Write down in the comments below and we'll get back to you. For this week and for this time being, I want to wish everybody a happy summer. I guess, is it fall now or the winter in the Southern Hemisphere? My name is Dawkins and we'll see you next time.